Hi, YouTube family. A pleasant good night to each and every one of you. Hope you had a wonderful, successful day today. I will be sharing another vegetarian dish. And this is no other but cabbage and carrot. This is simple, it is nutritious, and it's a beautiful dish that my hubby can't get enough of. So he already cut up the cabbage for me and with a jagged edge potato peeler, I'm just stripping some carrots into the cabbage because I wanna add some nice colors. I wanna make it very bright and beautiful. So I'm gonna continue with my carrots until I get enough pieces in here to satisfy my eyes. So here are my ingredients for my cabbage. Very simple and that's what I love about vegetable. Some good fresh ingredients and you don't have to put a lot. One onion, I have two head of cilantro, some garlic, marguerite pepper and I have here some green onions. I'm gonna go ahead and chop up my ingredients. I'm now chopping up my garlic. Now that I finished chopping up all the ingredients, we're gonna head on to the stove and prepare our cabbage and carrot. I just added the onions in the oil so we can fry it up a little before I go in with my garlic. I'm gonna go in with my garlic, green onions and pepper. We're gonna give this a good mix and we're gonna allow these to fry and mix in together. I'm gonna go in with my cabbage and carrot. So we're gonna go in with our fine thyme and I'm using Guyana fine thyme. Really love the thyme flavor from Guyana or fine thyme in general. I love to cook with fine thyme. So we're gonna mix this up. The thyme will add a beautiful flavor to our cabbage and as it's cooking along it's going to shrink down it's going to lose some of its natural water and we will have more flavor and less cabbage when it's done we're going to go in with our salt and mix We're gonna add our black pepper. I love lots of black pepper in my cabbage. So we're gonna mix all this goodness. And look how beautiful the color is, isn't it? And I will add my cilantro at the end when it's almost done. And cilantro really hype it up and give it a beautiful flavor. So what I like to do at this point, I'm gonna cover it down and let it spring up some water to soften up our cabbage a little. And then we'll come back and check it in about five minutes. Look how beautiful the cabbage is cooking up. It smells so good. I don't know how you like your cabbage, but we like ours steam cooked with a little bit of texture. So for this one here, I'm going to let it go for maybe two to three minutes more and this will be ready soon. We're going to go in with our cilantro and mix this in. And our cabbage and carrot is done. Beautiful looking 
vegetarian dish. So here is my delicious looking cabbage and carrot vegetarian style. Look how beautiful this look. I'm going to plate up and let you all know how this tastes. This is amazing for our vegetarian friends and even non-vegetarian. You can also add some meat or any of your favorite seafood to this dish. So let's plate it up. So before I do the taste test, Sister Donna tried our, our vegetable rice, broccoli and beet salad with her stew red peas. Let us check her success story out. Sister Donna, thank you for trying so many of my dishes and always sending me success story. I am very, very happy and proud of you for trying these dishes out and you always say how much you enjoy them. So she made the vegetable rice, broccoli, beet salad, and the stew peas, everything look amazing. So please remember to send those success story if you tried one of my recipe and you have pictures please remember to send them to me you can find me on facebook you can find me on instagram so here is my plate tonight my vegetarian cabbage carrots and a lot of fresh seasoning look how nice and beautiful this is cooked i'm gonna go in you can have this with roti or bread but i'm gonna go in for mine with some rice and I'm just gonna mix everything in and have a first mouthful for every one of you guys. Mm -mm 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 -mm. So delicious, so flavorful. You can get all those herbs are coming through, but a little bit high with the pepper, but that's how I love it. I love my vegetarian dishes to have that high pepper flavor because it make you enjoy the dish more i really like how the cabbage and the carrot goes well together so i'm gonna take another mouthful i know matthew's gonna enjoy this dish because he loves cabbage and he's waiting patiently to have his share of it so if you never had cabbage and carrot this way before please give it a try. If you like this recipe, please give us a thumbs up. If you're new to our channel, we hope you'll consider subscribing soon. Until then, we want to say stay blessed, stay safe. We love you guys. Bye for now.